Hi there, we're the nerd couple, I am husband and this is wife. Hello! Her hand, if you join us for the first time, we buy, sell, collect, retro, nerdy, gamey bits, etc. Charity shop haul time. Woo. This is a quite a few weeks worth. I think we seem to say that quite a lot now. Yeah. But, um, our local charity shops have been all atrocious recently. They've, I don't, uh, there's only really four we can look in now, but they're just, they're just crap. Yeah. Um, we did, then there's another town, a few from another town. There's some decent horror films. There's a box set. Oh, and a cat. There's a cat's head. Come on, baby. There's a mug. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll just go through what we got. There's some CEX fodder, you know, the usual. Yeah. The Invisible Man. Whoa. This was 99p. Um, I thought this would be worth a bit more than it is. Not that I really care, it's for the horror collection, but this is £2 at CEX, so mm. I mean, half price. Um, I don't know why this is an 18 it was a good film. It makes a change that an allegedly really good horror film is actually really good. <laughs> um, but I don't, I don't get why it's an 18. I don't remember it being an 18. No. But... I don't know. Especially, I mean, yes, it, by old horror film standards it would be, but it's not, you know, there's mm. like domestic abuse and what have you, but, you know, that's, I wouldn't have thought that was enough to make an 18. I don't know. I don't know. Then we have some 10 for a pounds. Whoa. This is annoying because they are 10 for a pound, but they often only have about 30 DVDs in there. <laughs> so it's often very hard to find anything. We only really wanted about three, or two yeah. maybe of these. There are some CDs there that did come with it, but we'll have to do them last because I don't think they're of interest to anyone apart from me. Yeah. VHS. Word. If I remember correctly, this was atrocious. Yeah, apart from maybe because it's like four things or yeah. something. I I can't remember how many. I remember one of them was so irritating. That's all I remember. <laughs> there was like a load of bros. Uh, but yeah, we have two for some reason, but not this one. Yeah, but you know, ten p for the horror collection, absolute classic. <laughs> if the, this was very okay, isn't it? I remember owning this twice previously, and neither copy worked. Uh, as in, they literally like not that they were scratched; they just didn't work. Like you put them in the disc, the drive, yeah. and they don't even recognise their films. There was obviously a dodgy batch yeah. or something. So I wonder if this is one of those ones. So we'll find out. I don't know what this is. I seem to think it's a horror film, even though it's a 12. I'm sure it was on some, like, Watch Mojo list of crap horror films of the noughties or something, but... I've never heard of it. I've heard of it. That's all I really remember. Okay. You you picked this, this up. This is one I picked up because I like the dumb, true story I seem to films. think you already have this, but I don't know. I, it's because all the covers look yeah. very, very similar. Yeah. So, yeah. That's, that's just for me. Gone Girl. I mean, it's sort of horror. I don't really, I don't really know. Yeah. 10p. Finding Nemo. Yeah, I've got Dory, but not Nemo. Terrifying for 10p. <laughs> now, the next two were two for a pound, which are very good value because, well, that's okay value. Nice Rider right, 2000, the movie. <laughs> I can get five pounds for this at CEX. So I then had to find another one. And then that, whatever that is, go tell the Spartans to screw themselves. Um, I can get like £1.50 at CEX, so for a quid, I can get £6.50. Not too bad. This is very good value. It's brand new, but at CEX, I think I can get £7 for it. And these were four for a quid. Mm. It was got Lionel Richie. Hell yeah. Which you can get a pound for. Two more horror films for the collection. Drag Me to Hell. Yeah. They don't even do 50p DVDs anymore. <laughs> Apparently, we've already got this. Yeah. Um, and from Fright Night. Yay. A relatively Which, decent remake. For some reason, we've got the original, but we don't have the remake. I, I like... I've not seen the original. I enjoy the original. I enjoy the remake. Anton Yelchin is always good. Yeah. And I've, and Imogen Poots is always good. Colin Farrell. And Tony Collette. I like that they're the only two to get a billing on the front. Pretty to look at. And there's also David Tennant, Imogen Poots, Tony Collette, <laughs> uh, McLovin. Yeah. <laughs> and then probably the slightly better side in terms of these things. Oh, cool. let's, let's do this first. You got a badge. Yeah, I couldn't log it. There are a <laughs> load of random South Park badges for 10p each. I don't really watch South Park anymore. I don't dislike it, we just don't really watch it. But we couldn't leave I couldn't that. leave a Cripple Fight for 10p. <laughs> uh, £2 Iron Man Trilogy box set. This isn't bad, bearing in mind, every box set in there seemed to be a pound a disc. Mm. But this was £2. So like, I think like random series were like £6 that are worth yes. nothing. Um <laughs> I mean, this isn't amazing. It's like six pound to buy at CEX, yeah. so but. But it's cool to have. Yeah, and you know, if, if things ever they start making another Iron Man eventually, they'll probably shoot up in value or something. 
Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Queen video. I got a video. We got a video. The video collection. Hell yeah. 99p from the same place we got Thing of Bob. Uh, the one with the same sticker. Yeah. Invisible Man. That's the one. We also had another Queen video for 2 99 Yeah, I refuse to pay 2 99 but I'll pay 99p. Yeah. This is simply just to go in my Queen collection. No idea what this is. Obviously, I mean, other than Two of Duty. But £2, I get £5 at CEX. Yeah, not bad. Not complaining for that. And then in the rest of those 10 for a pound, I got... Steps. 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 And can you guess what the last one will be? S Club. No, Steps. Got Steps. Yeah. I, 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 was, I was a Steps fan as a child. I'm still a massive fan of this one. Lisa. The dodgy one. The most beautiful one. And Faye, obviously. I'm not I'm not blind. And Lee. Um, <laughs> obviously. Obviously. Um, but, yeah, I mean, you know, Tim, I'm, I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I might just... I don't know. But Another yeah. 10p. Uh, we needed more in the 10 for a quid, so... So that'll do. Yeah. And... I got a mug. You got... I got a Wizard of Oz mug. Which... For 20p. I think looks fake as shit, but, I mean, it's... It's an official one. Yeah. It's a it's cool. half, half moon. Yes. It's cool. It's got a nice brown black stain. Oh, have you cleaned it now? I cleaned it. Yeah, it had a nice little stain in it. <laughs> yeah. It has gone. I've given it a wash. Complete with... There's a bit of soap suds. Oh. What was this 20p, did you it say? It was 20p. Yeah, I mean, if this is a legit thing, that ain't bad. Huh. Not good, Not as good as... That was a random set. Was like, uh, horror DVDs, Finding Nemo, Step CDs, A Cripple Fight badge, and <laughs> Wizard of Oz, Oz DVD from the same one. Uh, we won't waffle because the there's not much battery left yeah. and we have more to film. Yep. Like and subscribe and all that jazz. Yay. Au revoir, people. Bye-bye.